Hey guys, Ray again. Last week you saw me make this portable 12 volt power supply. I'll put a link in the description of this video and in the upper right of your screen. This week we're going to make a Tootsie Roll launcher. Yeah, the Tootsie Roll candies that we're all familiar with. I'm going to make a launcher to launch these guys. And I needed this to test out some of the valves I'll be using. It's a 12 volt solenoid valve that we're going to be testing out when we do all our setups. I think it's going to be an interesting project. Let's take a look at all the parts laid out on the table and then we'll get started on the build. Okay, so here are the parts. It's very simple. We've got a piece of PVC tubing, some caps, a piece of hose, air supply tank. We've got two solenoid valves. This one is three quarter and this one is quarter inch. Now, there's a reason why there are two valves and you'll, you'll catch on to that when you watch the video. But this one is gonna be the main dump valve. This valve here, if you look at that, it says 20 millimeter orifice. It's a three quarter inch valve, but 20 millimeter orifice. That means that it will dump all that air all in one shot, which is good. There's gonna be a lot of air getting all that force out of there. This little guy is a quarter inch valve and it only has a 2.5 millimeter orifice. So we're gonna use this one to feed this chamber from the main air tank. It's going to be an interesting build. Let's get started.
there it is. The launcher is ready or just about. Uh, what I need to do now is do the wiring. Let's turn on the power supply. Power supply is on. And luckily my solenoids are not on. The rear solenoid, you can hear that there, that's back here. That's working. The dump one, the dump valve, you can hear that, that's pretty loud. That's my dump valve. So let's go ahead and charge this up here. Okay, that's equalizing with the pressure in my compressor tank. Our power supply is on. Let's charge the air, the air tank. Okay, good. This is closed. All we did was pressurize the hose. Let me open it up a little bit. There it goes. Gonna just the 20 PSI. So let me see if I can back this up so you can see the nozzle. Are you ready? Here we go. That's, you know what? At 20 PSI, that's impressive. Um, I'm gonna do something stupid. Let's do something stupid. Here we go. I'm loading it up without pressure in the chamber. You cannot do this with pressure in the chamber. I'm just gonna push this one in. It's a mess. Th that's a mess. All right, we're gonna charge the chamber. You ready for this? Charge the chamber. That's it, we're at 30 PSI. Here we go. Wow. I don't know whether they're hitting the wall and then they're just going everywhere. I got no idea. So, I'm gonna take this over to the main shop. I got room over there. And uh, we're going to do a little test fire, see how far that gets us, and we're going to crank it up. We're going we're gonna to see how much she can take. All right, guys, we're back at the, sh at the workshop, and take a look down this lane. That building is 100 foot long. We're going to try to see how far we get it launched, and uh, it should be pretty interesting, so come and take a look at this. We've got 100 PSI in the pressure tank over here. We've got our 12 volt battery. And here we go with the launcher. You can see we got zero pressure. All right, so here's how we're gonna do it. Here is our ammunition, Tootsie Rolls, just as I promised. I'm gonna put it in the barrel. Fits very nice. We're gonna give it a little tampity tamp, like an old muzzle loader. Tap it down at the bottom. This is, this is on, we got power. I'm going to charge the tank, or gonna charge the pressure chamber. I got zero. Check it out. I'm going to turn the pressure up. Can you see the valve there? Mm -hmm. We are at 20 PSI. Just a pinch over 20. Here we go. We're gonna launch. Are we ready? <laughs> that almost made it to the end of the building. And that's at 20 PSI. But you know what? 20 PSI is not enough. Let's load another Let's load up another one. Shall we go? Should we go 30 first? Yeah. Or should we do like tell you what, let's do let's do 50 first. We're gonna you see we're at zero. I'm gonna charge the, the chamber. Chamber charges to 20. We're gonna ramp that up. There we go. That's 50 in the chamber. How much do we got left in the tank? We're at 90 in the tank. 85, 90. So now we're fully charged. Mm-hmm. Uh, that went past the dumpster. <laughs> wow, I am surprised that we got that much out of it. That's only a 50. Let's recharge this tank and give it another shot at 100. That's at 50. That's at 80. That's at 90. That's about all we're getting out of here. It dropped. You ready? Mm -hmm. Alright guys, well there you have it. The Tootsie Roll Candy Launcher in time for Halloween. And no, I am not going to actually shoot anybody with this guy. I'll tell you again, this thing is dangerous. Don't build this at home. If you do so, you do so at your own risk. Uh, but uh, it's, it's pretty fun. Thank you all for watching. Please don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And hit that little bell to stay updated to date on my future videos. But I've got one more launch in this tank. And I'm going to take it.
Thanks again.